It's time for some more app ideas. We're talking about heavy hitter SaaS concepts for data management. What's good, softwarepreneurs? Welcome back to Swattage, the software innovation lab. If you're new here, my name is Dale Richards. I'm a software innovator from Salt Lake City, Utah, and I love building software that changes the world. I'm creating a SaaS product from concept to cash, and I'm taking you with me for the ride. If you want to change the world, build apps, grow your SaaS business, and make money doing cool software entrepreneur related stuff, start now by subscribing and hitting the bell. As I was reviewing uh, some of the market data that was coming across from markets and markets, I noticed that a lot of the common threads that I was seeing in all of these uh, market reports was that there were big opportunities that had to do with data, data management, databases. So I want to share with you four app ideas or four SaaS product concept ideas uh, that have to deal with data management and databases. These concepts are not for the faint of heart. These are not um, simple apps for the consumer, basically. This isn't the kind of app that basically, you know, your friend is going to download from the app store and use on his phone to play a game. We're talking about enterprise technology solutions to manage data for uh, institutions like banks, um, like media companies, stuff like that. So typically we're talking about a business to business model. So keep that in mind as you listen to these ideas. FinTech data as a service. So the pain point here is that financial institutions uh, like banks, uh, credit unions, they store data about all their transactions and they have difficulty combining data to create meaningful insights. Uh, that's one problem. Also, they have some pretty hefty um, compliance requirements. So they have to comply with, uh, with federal regulations, uh, state laws and stuff to keep their data uh, secure and safe. And so uh, they have to report on how they're using and storing that data, how they're processing that data. Uh, so the game creator here is if you had a solution that could reduce data storage costs, by providing customers with data storage and querying in the cloud. So rather than the bank storing all of the transaction data on one of the bank's servers, they just pay you to store data on your server instead. Another game creator, we wanna speed up time for compliance reporting by collating data from multiple sources. Uh, so this is not just like, hey, store the data in the cloud. It also has to do with, okay, well, how are we enabling the customer to query the data? So that bank, are we giving them tools to link data together and to draw meaningful insights from that data. Uh, this specific opportunity is expected to grow from 12 billion in 2020 to 24.8 billion in 2025. That is a compound annual growth rate of 15.7%. A revenue pricing app. So the pain here is that companies can't maximize their revenue because they don't know how much to charge. Basically, they don't know about all the pricing opportunities that are available to them. So a SaaS solution that could create gains for a client like this um, would mine internet data to provide personalized pricing and tailor products for customers depending upon their attributes. Uh, so a, a pricing management solution like this could make use of smart algorithms for data mining and smart pricing algorithms, thus using the, the information to arrive at better pricing and promotions for enterprises. Uh, this opportunity uh, is slated to grow uh, from 14.1 billion in 2019 to 22.4 billion in 2024. That's a compound annual growth rate of 9.6%. That's not the greatest, not, not as big as some of the other ones we're gonna look at, but, but still, there's some opportunity there. Product info management app. So we're talking about companies that have a lot of products they need to sell. They need to have data about those products. Uh, and in a lot of cases, they don't even have the right data in the right places. Like maybe they've got multiple data tables, the data's not syncing, they don't really know what they have to sell. So for example, sellers of digital multimedia assets. So think like Hulu, Netflix, uh, anybody who's selling like, um, data, like video rentals or, or video purchases like streaming video. They don't have the right tools to easily see everything that they have to sell. Uh, there are data inconsistencies that make it cumbersome to bring new products to market. So the game creator here is to improve synchronization and publication of information about product attributes. So data about media clips, sound recordings, images, text files. Uh, if we could have a product info management app that could <clears throat> guide the company into having better data, more synchronized data across their different data silos, that could help companies know, hey, we have all the stuff that we could be selling. Let's go ahead and sell it. This opportunity expected to grow from USD 7 billion in 2019 to 11.4 billion by 2024. That's a 10.2 compound annual growth rate. 
And number four, encryption software as a service. So the pain point here is that companies, they have to store a lot of data, that data is lost or stolen. They also have heavy burdens to comply with data security requirements. And also customers, like their customers don't feel safe with their data vulnerable to uh, cyber attacks and stuff like that. So the game creator here is that encryption keeps the data safe until the data owner finds it again. Uh, or the customer personal data is kept private and companies don't have to worry about their own data security. So you provide them with uh, an encryption as a service software solution. Uh, they buy your service, you encrypt the data for them, and they don't have to worry about that. Uh, this opportunity is expected to grow from 9.8 billion in 2020 to 20.1 billion in 2025. That's a compound annual growth rate of 15.5%. So that's, that's actually larger than some of the other ones that we looked at today. So there you go, four SaaS product concepts for you to think about, four app ideas, you know, SaaS ideas. Uh, not for the faint of heart, if you can dive in and solve these solutions, there are some mega bucks waiting for you around the corner. Big opportunities, um, but, but kind of heavy on the execution. So good luck. Make sure you subscribe for more app ideas. Join us again. Videos are published every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 12 noon Mountain Time.